In the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. I believe in God, God the Father Amen. Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. On the third day, he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven, and he is seated at the right hand of God, the Father Almighty. From thence he shall come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. For the intentions of the Pope. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, and thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. For an increase of faith. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For an increase of hope. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For an increase in love. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, Amen. is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Brief reflection on sorrowful mysteries. What is it that we seek when we pray the rosary? Do we seek to check a box on some spiritual practice that makes us feel better? Um, do we buzz through the rosary quickly and uh, without uh, true attention and devotion. If we pray this way, we'll never know the fruits of the mystery, which many of those who are leading us have already spoken in each of the mysteries. We'll never know the one uh, to whom the rosary is supposed to lead us, the one to whom the Blessed Mother points to, to do whatever he says, to follow him. But when we pray as we ought, we pray, as St. Teresa of Avila said in the interior castle, we pray recognizing who we are and who God is. And as we pray, we're actually praying to the Blessed Mother to lead us to Jesus. We're not just saying words. We're not just saying our prayers, but we're praying our prayers. And when we pray this way, when we pray in a way that is more meditative and contemplative, which is the, the intent of the rosary then comes to fruition, which is to lead us to Jesus. And when we come to see Jesus as he truly is, we are stripped bare of all of our self-delusion. We come to understand all that hinders our own ascent to union with him, all that keeps us from following him, all that hinders our love for all those he's placed in our care. And we come to that realization for the same reason those in the first century, when they met Jesus, came to those realizations where their lives changed. Mary Magdalene from a harlot to a saint. Many others we could list that he encountered the woman at the well. When they encounter Jesus as he truly is, 
They discover who they are. They discover their eternal destiny. And so as we look to the sorrowful mysteries, in particular, we come to recognize the great price that Jesus paid for us on his way to Calvary. We recognize that his, suffer didn't be, his suffering didn't begin uh, at the scourging at the pillar. No, it began long before that, but came to very intense and incredibly difficult moment when he had to face what was coming in the agony of the garden, when he had to see what, as the catechism reveals, the consequence it would, would be that all of our sins are placed upon him. It makes me wonder who would bring into existence his own executioner, yet he brought us out of his love. And how have we repaid him? And the sorrowful mysteries reveal exactly how we've repaid him. We, by our sins, have caused him to suffer immeasurably beyond anything any mere mortal could ever understand or know. But when we begin to catch a glimpse of this reality, we can't help but be changed. When we recognized that he suffered across all time and eternity for our sins, we recoil at the idea that we would sin again because we think that maybe one of those sins would be one of the stripes that was laid upon his back. And we begin to reject all that keeps us from him all that does not bring us to praise him, to give the entirety of our lives to him. The scourging at the pillar, a moment that changed dramatically one of the greatest saints in the church, St. Teresa of Avila. Her meditations on this suffering of Christ brought her conversion in 1554 when she was in the convent of La Encarnacion outside of Avila, Spain. And it was such a profound moment because she, she came to see Jesus and to experience him in the scourging that it radically changed her entire uh, life as a nun, as a cloistered Carmelite. And from that point on, over the next 20 years, she established 17 convents across Spain and turn the world upside down with what it really means to encounter the living God in prayer and to be transformed by that encounter. In the rosary, we have that opportunity if we would but slowly meditate on the suffering of Christ and allow Mary to show us her own suffering and his suffering combined for our salvation and the salvation of the world. We pray that in all of this time and gathering together and listening to all of these beautiful hearts and minds, lifting up these mysteries, allowing Mary to lead us ever more deeply into the heart of God, that our reflections together 7,000 Catholics standing together, praying for the church, praying for one another, praying for all of the difficulties we, we face and all of the needs that we have that only God can provide for, that we don't forget to enter into the mystery. Because when we do that, when we encounter Christ as he truly is, when we become aware of what he's truly done for us, it is impossible for us to remain the same. It is impossible for us not to be changed and thereby the world to be changed 
around us. In the first sorrowful mystery, the agony in the garden. I would like to offer up this um, decade of the rosary for all the holy souls in purgatory and for all of those loved ones, for all of those prayer who might be in purgatory. So we lift uh, our hearts up with that intention in this decade. And the meditation is from Luke chapter 22, verses 39 to 46. And he came out and went, as was his custom, to the Mount of Olives. And the disciples followed him. And when he came to the place, he said to them, pray that you may not enter into temptation. And he withdrew from them about a stone's throw and knelt down and prayed. Father, if thou art willing, remove this cup from me. Nevertheless, not my will, but thine be done. And there appeared to him an angel from heaven, strengthening him. And being in agony, he prayed more earnestly, and his sweat became like great drops of blood falling down upon the ground. And when he rose from prayer, he came to the disciples and found them sleeping for sorrow. And he said to them, why do you sleep? Rise and pray that you may not enter into temptation. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come that will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, in agony in the garden for us. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, in agony in the garden for us. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, in agony in the garden for us. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary. Full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, in agony in the garden for us. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, in agony in the garden for us. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, in agony in the garden for us. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, in agony in the garden for us. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus in agony in the garden for us. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, in agony in the garden for us. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, 
in agony in the garden for us. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And may the fruits of this mystery, conformity to God's will, come down into our souls. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those who are most in need of thy mercy. Amen. Pray for us, Mary, Mother of Sorrows, that we may humbly embrace God's will in all things. The, um, the scourging at the pillar. And uh, to prepare us for this, I'd like you to intercede in a very, very special way for all of those who have been unjustly punished. And let's also pray for all of those who, who are suffering beyond the, uh, uh, the, the, the limits of human suffering, who've been pushed over the edge. Tonight, let's ask Jesus to be present to these souls wherever they are in the world. This is from the prophet of uh, the prophet Isaiah. I gave my back to those who struck me and my cheeks to those who pulled out my beard. I hid not my face from shame and spitting for the Lord God helps me. Therefore, I have not been confounded. Therefore, I have set my face like flint. And I know that I shall not be put to shame. He who vindicates me is near. And again, from the prophet Isaiah 53. Four through six. Surely he has borne our griefs and carried our sorrows. Yet we esteemed him stricken, struck down by God and afflicted. But he was wounded for our transgressions. He was bruised for our iniquities. Upon him was the chastisement that made us whole. And with his stripes, we are healed. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, by whose stripes we are healed. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, by whose stripes we are healed. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus by whose stripes we are healed. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, by whose stripes we are healed. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, 
and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, by whose stripes we are healed. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, by whose stripes we are healed. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, by whose stripes we are healed. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, by whose stripes we are healed. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, by whose stripes we are healed. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. All glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins and save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those who have most need of thy mercy. Hello. The third sorrowful mystery is Jesus' crowning with thorns. We're going to pray this decade of the rosary for the conversion of poor sinners and for an increase in vocations to the priesthood and religious life. The soldiers weave a crown of thorns and press it onto Christ's head. The fruit of the mystery is moral courage. We're taking our scripture meditation from the Gospel of Matthew and the Gospel of John. And they stripped him and put a scarlet robe upon him. And plating a crown of thorns, they put it on his head. And put a reed in his right hand. And kneeling before him, they mocked him, saying, Hail, King of the Jews. And they spat upon him and took the reed and struck him on the head. Pilate went out again and said to them, Behold, I am bringing him out to you, that you may know that I find no crime in him. So Jesus came out, wearing the crown of thorns and the purple robe. Pilate said to them, Here is the man. When the chief priests and the officers saw him, they cried out, Crucify him, crucify him. Pilate said to them, Take him yourselves and crucify him, for I find no crime in him. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us of our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, who is crowned with thorns for us. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, who is crowned with thorns for us. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, who is crowned with thorns for us. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, 
who is crowned with thorns for us. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, who is crowned with thorns for us. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, who is crowned with thorns for us. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, who is crowned with thorns for us. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, who is crowned with thorns for us. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, who is crowned with thorns for us. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, who is crowned with thorns for us. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. May all glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, as it is now, and ever shall be, a world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us of our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Pray for us, Mary, Mother of Sorrows, that we may witness to the gospel, even at cost to ourselves. The fourth sorrowful mystery, the carrying of the cross. The fruit of this mystery is patience. We will offer this fourth decade of the rosary for those who are far from God, that they may experience the gift of contrition and receive God's mercy in the sacrament of, of reconciliation. Jesus carries his heavy cross to Calvary. Our meditation comes from John 19, 17 and Luke 23, 26. So they took Jesus and he went out bearing his own cross as they led him away. They seized one Simon the Cyrene who was coming from the country to carry it behind Jesus. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, who has raised his cross for us. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, who has raised his cross for us. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, who embraced his cross for us. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, who embraced his cross for us. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. 
who embrace the constructs, the alcohol, the other great for us, and then the now, the alcohol, the other Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of God in Jesus. Who embraced his cross for us, holy Mary, mother of God, great for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of God in Jesus. Who embraced his cross for us, holy Mary, mother of God, great for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Who had embraced his cross for us. Holy Mary, mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Who had embraced his cross for us. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for our sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in the most need of our mercy. Pray for us, Mary, Mother of Sorrow, that we may practice patience with ourselves and with others. The fifth sorrowful mystery, the crucifixion, and uh, the particular fruit of this mystery that uh, we are, are, are praying for is salvation. Uh, our intention is going to be for all of our brothers and sisters in Christ uh, who are trying to be intentional disciples of Jesus Christ uh, to, to know how much Jesus Christ thirsts to be in a real relationship, an authentic relationship, in a living and vital relationship with each and every single one of us. We read from the Gospel of John. When the soldiers had crucified Jesus, they took his garments and made four parts, one for each soldier, also his tunic. For the tunic was without seam woven from top to bottom, so they said to one another, Let us not tear it, but cast lots for it to see whose it shall be. This was to fulfill the scripture. They parted my garments among them, and from my clothing they cast lots. So the soldiers did this, but standing by the cross of Jesus were his mother and his mother's sister, Mary, the wife of Clopas, and Mary Magdalene. When Jesus saw his mother and the disciple whom he loved standing near, he said to his mother, Woman, behold your son. Then he said to the disciple, Behold your mother. And from that hour the disciple took her to his own home. After this, Jesus, knowing that all was now finished, said to fulfill the scripture, I thirst. A bowl full of vinegar stood there, so they put a sponge full of vinegar on the hyssop and held it to his mouth. When Jesus had received the vinegar, he said, It is finished. And he bowed his head and gave up his spirit. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our, our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, who was crucified for us. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, who was crucified for us. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, who was crucified for us. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. And blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, who was crucified for us. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, who was crucified for us. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus who was crucified for us. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, 
now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, who was crucified for us. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, who was crucified for us. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, who is crucified for us. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus, who is crucified for us. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. All glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Amen. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother, Mother of mercy, mercy, our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee do we cry for thy To thee do we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping in this valley of tears. Turn then, most gracious advocate, Thine eyes of mercy toward us, and after this our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. O God, whose only begotten Son, by his life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal salvation, Grant, we beseech thee, that by meditating upon these mysteries of the Most Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, that we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. In the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit. Amen. Gosh, I was filled with joy praying with all of these great men and women who lead the church in uh, individual ways and in uh, broader ways and just was thinking that tonight um, all that gathered the cumulative effect of all of these works and all of these apostolic works and all of these ministries and all of these people praying together already affects millions of people millions of catholics people around the world what an honor what a what a humbling honor to be able to pray uh, on this night for all these beautiful intentions with all of these really remarkable lay religious bishops priests uh, very beautiful before we go i want to mention a few things that you can check out one is if you were intrigued by the method they were praying uh, you notice there was a clause in the middle of each rosary there we go and that um they had uh, the fruits and the mystery and prayers after each mystery and all of that. If you want to deepen your uh, prayer life in the rosary and really have the rosary draw you into uh, something that's well beyond what's normally prayed in terms of uh, our coming to union with God and contemplative graces, this book, uh, the contemplative rosary is what uh, everyone was following tonight. 